<laughs> when you were a young man, Cormac Turner, growing up in Dublin, people have often said Dublin before the First World War was the poorest city in Europe. How poor was it? Well, it was wretched, miserable. Barefooted children in rags, scarcely a stitch, shivering with the cold, the common sight on the streets. The fathers and mothers were no better off, in a way, you know. Wages were very small, you know, and things were really in the slum. Things live life in slums was horrible. What about jobs, and what about the effects of the 1913 strike? Was it a very depressed city? Oh, it was, very. Things, business was at a standstill virtually during the 1913 strike. And the food parcels coming over from England to the strikers, see them going down to the boat to collect their parcels, it was about all they had to live on. There was a lot of excitement at that time among middle-class Dubliners because some children were taken away, they were taken to Britain to be fed, and there was a lot of talk about them being kidnapped. Do you remember yes, that? Yes, there was. The, I think it was the engine order of Hibernians who were mainly behind that, uh, suggested that they were taken away to be proselytised and all this type of thing. There was no truth, of course, in that. It was really compassionate people in England, I think, that were you know, sympathetic to the labour movement and knew what the children, the hearts of the children were suffering through the lockout. How strong was the labour movement after that great strike, Cormac Turner? Well, the, uh, the labour movement was fairly strong then, you know, that well, uh, well, I wouldn't say, in the, probably the, the uh, unskilled labourers were well organised, but I don't think if that all the skilled tradesmen were properly organised at the time, but they weren't so much affected by the strike as the unskilled. It was the people who uh, would normally join the workers' union, the Irish Transport Workers' Union, Larkin's Unionist was known. Those were the people that were hardest hit. Do you, did you have any 